Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Elden Ring here in Volcano Manor. And yes, I have killed Lord Rikard, and I'm actually still using, or, or wielding, I'm not actually going to be using that very same weapon. Also, I have 166,000 runes and five more rune arcs. Why is that? Well, because I did some co-op. I finally actually did. I got online, I decided who else needs help with this boss, because I've learned some things, and uh, hopefully in the pinned comment, if I remember to do that in, in the episode titles, you will already know what I've learned, but um, yeah, in that fight, it's not just the Ash of War skill with the L2 button that causes those giant wind attacks, it's all attacks. All attacks. R1, R2, jumping R1, jumping R2, rolling R1, running R1, all of it, all of it, all of it, all of it does that. This re revelation came because I was talking about my difficulties with the boss fight in Discord. And by the way, stop making me say it. Just join the Discord. We'd love to have you. And a few people said, oh, really? I didn't find him that difficult. In phase 2, when I was running from the skulls, I just hit him with the R1. I thought, you're you're running up to him and smacking him? They said, no, I'm using the wind attack. And I said, come again. And, um, yeah, that's how we learned that you can kill him <laughs> without just doing the L2. Now... In my defense, and maybe not my defense, because I'm actually going to, to test this right now. I read the description of this weapon when I first picked it up. And to me, to me, it says that it is the Ash of War that allows for that unique attack against serpents. Okay, now we're going to look at this description again to see. Weapon that serves as both greatsword and spear thought to have been used to hunt an immortal great serpent in the distant past and manifest a long blade of light when facing such a creature. Okay, right away. No, I'm wrong. <laughs> when their master's heroic aspirations degenerated into mere greed, his men searched for a weapon with which they might halt their lord. Now, the unique skills great serpent hunt perform a, a powerful forward lunge and follow up with an upward thrust via additional input. When fighting a great serpent, a long blade of light will appear, revealing the armament's true power. So, that is the part that caught my attention that said, okay, the Ash of War will have a special attack. However, however, that second sentence, it manifests a long blade of light when facing such a creature, that tells me that all attacks would do it. So that's on me. I'm accepting that. I'm going to now end this episode uh, early so I can go cry myself to sleep. Dog on it. <laughs> Dog on it. All right, real quick. We are here back in Volcano Manor because with Lord Riker dead, I'm curious what Lady Tanith has to say. I mean, really and truly, she has to say something, right? And by the way, now that we are 15 and 15, yeah, it's actually health time. We're actually going to dump some into Vigor. Look at that, 25 Vigor, if you can believe it. The rest I'm probably just going to spend on consumable items here in a little bit so I don't run into that necessity to farm again anytime soon. Uh, we're also going to, yeah, I was testing this. The making the stance break easier, nah, that didn't do anything. So I'm going to keep Opaline, and I'm probably just going to go back to my... What is the one that gives me... There we go, the Magic Shrouding. That's what we want. And we'll be going back to my spells and my staffs here in just a little bit. But first, um, let's see what I've done. You. It's true, then. You've defeated our lord. No. I must thank you. Our lord was yet weak. You have taught us that. Defeat is not the end. Our lord is immortal, and will one day rise again. Stronger. Until then, I must stay the path, and do my part. I will leave the Volcano Manor before long. I suggest you do the same. I will miss these encounters. The champion who walks the tainted path shines all the more. I always was an admirer. This is farewell. Perhaps we will meet again along the path. Well, Lady Tanith is leaving, and she actually thanked me for killing Lord Rikard, only because she believes that he's going to come again. Now she, she is. She's gone. Did, did anyone else leave? I mean, oh, hello. I still don't know who that was that was talking to me. Probably shame on me, right? My thanks. Hey, I got a gesture out of that. That's pretty cool. And now it's just down to you, my friend. So, 
You killed Rikard. I harbor you no ill will. The strong take. Such is our code. Even he was prepared to meet a wretched end when he first took blasphemy unto his very flesh. But any road, the Volcano Manor is no more. Though we may yet fulfill an old promise. We hunted our own kind and took what was theirs. And with everything in hand, the time has come to rise against the Erd Tree. So we're still going after the Erd Tree. I haven't made up my mind yet whose side I'm on. I never really liked Volcano Manor because as I expressly stated, I don't like the idea of killing other tarnished. It's a, it's a selfish means to an end. Oh, greater will, hear my voice. I am the recusant Bernal, inheritor of my brother's will, and you will fall to my blade. We refuse to become your pawns. Consider this fair warning. Bernal, I don't, I wouldn't call that a blade. Oh, great. I am the I like that though. I like that he's just telling the greater will that uh, he's he's coming for it. So is that is that it then? Are we are we done with Volcano Manor? Now I know that there were some areas down in the lower sections because of course we had that magma worm. I don't think I'm actually going to doors block shut. What am I supposed to do to get in there? Maybe maybe I've now locked myself out because I didn't actually follow all their quests. Did I did I lose out on their quests? No, the targets are still there. So I don't know. I actually don't know how I get in there. Now, one thing to note is I was told that I missed some items by going here directly because of the invitation from Zarias or Raya that I missed some things and I don't actually know how to get to Volcano Manor without using that. My only thought is maybe this right here. So that's the Wyndham Catacomb. So perhaps there's a bridge there. So actually, 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 okay. So there's the Noble Gold Mass. If I take this path down here, cross that bridge, head up here, cross this bridge, maybe? I don't know. I'm not really sure. So yeah, look at that. Recusant, Bernal, and Patches. Those are the only two left. Does Patches have anything new? I'm sure he doesn't. Now you've gone and killed Rykard. <laughs> you scheming little bastard. Cripes, you make this nonsense seem, well, <laughs> less nonsensical. Perhaps a Tarnished will be Elden Lord after all. But for now, this manor is finished. The demigod beast is slain, and Tanith has lost her head. A fine mess. But how else could it end? When Daddy Ambition's head over heels courting Lady Blasphemy. <laughs> <laughs> well, here I am, untethered, once again. Goodbye, my friend. So now you're heading out as well. What is it? Oh, come to make a parting donation. Okay. Everyone's just leaving me. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't be sad about that. Has anything changed upstairs? I doubt it, but let's just take one last look. Yeah, so I don't think I'm going to go down back into the underbelly of Volcano Manor. Oh, you know what? You know what, actually, now that I think about it, not the prison town church, not the temple, this one right here. I Maybe this is the path? Because the subterranean inquisition chamber, this is where we got stuck by the two iron virgins. So maybe we'll come and take, uh, take them on a little bit, but first, we're gonna head to the round table hold. I got a remembrance from Lord Reichardt, and we need to see what that offers me with the finger reader. Probably nothing I can use, but we shall see. Probably the sword, which is just a crazy looking sword. Uh, first off, any new equipment? No, does not look like it. I can't get the briar set. Elmer murdered numerous instructors and merchants as, and was known as the bell hunter. Yeah, I just wanted to know more about the bell bearing hunters. Okay, so we get, yep, the blasphemous blade. Taker's Flames. Remains of the countless heroes he has devoured writhe upon the surface of this blade. 
Now they share the same blood, bound together as family. Some HP is restored upon defeating an enemy. The Taker's Flames is the unique skill. Raise the Sacred Sword aloft to set it ablaze with blasphemous flames. Then bring it down to set to fire off a forward blast. The flames steal HP from those. They touch 22 strength, 21 faith. And then this. Hello, this is a sorcery. This is Rikard's Rancor. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Faith of 18. I can do that with America's uh, Scar Seal. Summon searing spirits that leave a trail of delayed explosions in their wake. Sounds awesome. These spirits manifest from the rancor of heroes who met a violent end. The Lord granted them an audience, whereupon they were welcomed by the maw of the great serpent, and within the serpent's bowels they became the Lord's kin. Takes two slots. There we go. I am, uh, I am digging it. Now, do I, uh, I kind of want to start spending my runes on buying all the armor just so I have it. But I don't think so. Instead, let's take a quick trip over here before we actually go and buy some consumables. Well, to eat I want to see own. what we can upgrade here with my magical staffs, if any. No, it doesn't look like it. Because I need smithing stone threes, if you can believe it. Hopefully I find a bell bearing that lets me buy those soon, because otherwise I don't know where to go get threes. That's going to be a real bummer to be stuck on that. I could do my horn bow a little higher, but no, let's do, we could do misery cord. I haven't been using that in a while. Also, I still need to add that ash of war, that assassin's ash of war on there. Okay. All right. I think we're actually good on that. Now I want to take a quick look at my map. I want to see, am I missing any, any mines? You know, they show up as that little cave symbol. So they're. Not too difficult to spot, but I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. And you know what? I wonder, maybe I should go and try and kill this guy because I'm getting bell bearings from the hunters. What if one of them actually drops the upgrade materials? That could be, all right, just a quick scan for more mines. See if I've missed any. Not seeing any jumping out at me and up here this is probably going to be too this would be too high level anyway if I were to find him right yeah I think so I think so Celevis is still hanging out there I can't do anything with him because he's still waiting for me what is going to open up the chest of Nala's room by the way I have no idea he's still waiting on me to give a potion to uh, Nephili even though Oh, right, Tregot. That's, uh, that's Patches. And he's in there. Hmm. <laughs> options. Options, options, options. Okay. Right. Uh, can we do any upgrading with our spirits, though? I could do... Oh, that's... That's a Warhawk. I don't... When did I equip the Warhawk? Time out. Oh, no. You're telling me that on my winning attempt, I had the... <laughs> when I was naked, without consumables, I used the Warhawk and I won? What a terrible self-imposed challenge. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, Greetings, that's terrible. Yes. And also hilarious. Right. Uh, <laughs> I'm not even upset. I think that's great. Uh, I do want to actually work on this one because I want to see how many rats I get. Oh, look at that. It actually does change in the description. So I'm up to four and looks like er, still at four. Okay. But you know what? I think that'd be fun to try. So let's, uh, yeah, let's, let's switch that out. Let's get the rats on. Probably not going to be the best for those iron virgins. And I am going to now just go blow the rest of this on consumables, some lumps of flesh, some hefty beast bones, what else? Turtleneck meat. You know the drill. Uh, you don't. You didn't even mention Lord Rykard. Do you have anything to say? No. Okay. Should just just stop saying words. Right. Dung eater still hanging out. Do you have anything else to say? By the way, I, no, because you already told me that you will defile my corpse, and that's just that doesn't sit well with me. Okay. So tops, D's, and uh, Let's see. We definitely want. I'm going to buy these. 
I'm gonna buy those first and foremost. Uh, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna buy 10. I'm gonna buy 10. I have 20 of those, so I'm, I actually don't care about those. I have plenty of two, ones and twos. I have plenty, wow, I have plenty of one, two, three. Well, I could buy yeah, a few more of those. I don't really need them right now though. So let's, I just want to spend really all my money. This is actually kind of, what do you, I guess you just get a rune art from doing those, huh? Uh, sliver of meats, I definitely don't need. Can I buy, let's do another five. Another five. And let's just cap it off, right? There we go. All right. So now we are going to, first off, I need to set up my my spells again. So here's what we're going to do. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. So Terra Magica Renala's, which I don't have 70 faith. That's okay. We'll fix that. Magic Glint Blade's good. Glintstone Pebble, eh. I'll leave the bubble. Nightman's miss, probably not. I think I do want to try out the new ranker call. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then what else? What else could be good against those those dual iron virgins? You know, maybe just some arc, right? Okay. So that's good. So now we get rid of that. We're gonna put on my Lusats. And then we are gonna put on some of the other complementary magic staffs like what stone digger no full moon yes and is that it i mean that might actually be it because we're not using any gravities okay but this is what we're going to run with this is what we're going to run with Huh. Also, I want to take one more look at the Great Rune for Rikard. Divine Tower of West Altus, which stands upon the precipice at the coast southwest of Laidel. West Altus. I mean, I'm just... I can probably go see it if I'm outside. I'm just trying to imagine... I mean, if this is if this is the capital, because that's the divine bridge. Where? Wait a minute. Is it? No, that's a converted fringe tower. Well, I'd I'd have to probably come over here and just take a look at it. That is uh, quite possible. Okay, subterranean inquisition cham uh, chamber. Let's do it. Let's make this happen. Let's get some progress. Let's just explore a little bit more. Yeah, this is what we want, right? I uh, don't actually remember. You know, I do want to. Let's get Misery Cord. Oh, right. We forgot. We forgot about Misery Cord. Keep forgetting about Misery Cord and my wonderful, wonderful Ash of War. So we are going to do Assassin's Gambit. Yes. Okay. What would be my best option here? Is it still standard? I mean, that's 210. That's 208. That's less. <laughs> Do we, let's put... Do we want to? No. I need to try that out. I need to try that out. I actually haven't used it because it seems so, so silly. Oh, you can't put one on... You can't put one on Lusats, huh? All right, is this a backstab opportunity? No? Oh, look at that. I didn't even realize that I was killing these guys already. Okay. It's also been so long that I don't remember where the boss arena even was. Oh no, it's been far too long. Did I have to do some, some parkour? I did, didn't I? All right, let's try and recall. 
don't think it was there. I think I had to go behind. So, I think I had to do like some of this. Go, 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 go. I also maybe, maybe 100% should have reallocated my flasks now that I think about it. I don't remember if there was a Stake of America. Yeah, I think. Does it drop right into the boss fight? It might. All right, let's just go for it. Uh, no. No, it does not. Hmm. Okay. I, it's been it's been long enough that I don't remember at all, which is not surprising because even if it's only been a few minutes, I will likely have forgotten it anyway. Okay, was it just maybe past here? No stake. No stake America. Okay. We're just going to have to hope for the best. And I didn't put my talismans on. Oh, blue. Okay. Oh, Gemini. Okay. Uh, they're actually doing well right now? Um, and, and going after that one at least. Okay, well, we're. I don't know how well we're gonna do here. Just because, uh. Oh, I got grabbed. And my rats are just about dead. Yeah. Yeah. This is silly. Oh, oh. Oh boy. Watch it. Okay, there goes the rest of my rats. Oh, jeez. Watch the grab. Yeah, it's just, it's not gonna happen. I mean, I totally forgot everything I was supposed to do. Ah. <laughs> Although this is actually doing a really good job at damaging you. Oh, that's dead, that's death. Okay, okay, hold on. Hold on, we're alive. Oh, jeepers, 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 jeepers. I don't even think I can use like any of these, can I? I mean, that's great damage. Open up, would you, you coward? Maybe I should actually just stay close. And then just dodge the grab, like that. Because that's so much more damage. Like, significantly more damage. Oh, and you're still open. Okay, just about got it. Oh yeah, all right, we got it. Without even, you know, trying. <laughs> and going back to my Glintstone art. Inquisitor's Garandol? Definitely don't know what that uh, means or is, but probably pronounce it incorrectly anyway. Some sort of spear weapon. Okay. Causes blood buildup. Instrument of torture used on nobles behind the curtain at the volcano manor of Mount Gelman. So is that what these are? All these poor souls in you know that are being locked up in the locks and that have magma poured in their heads, those are nobles? Its numerous spikes pierce the flesh, then singe the wounds with flame. The smell of burnt blood induces despair in the victim. A candlestick conceived by a thorough mind. Charge forth, quickly charge forward. Okay, so pretty standard there. All right. Neat, I suppose. Neat. So is this going to be the approach then to Volcano Manor? Also, maybe I should ch change a few things here. Oh, boy. The rats are cool, though. I actually kind of thought the rats were neat. So flasks, we're gonna go back to, yeah, four and seven, I like that. And then we are also, oh my gosh, this is this is so bad. This is really, really cool if you're using Ash of War a lot. I'm not though, I'm not. So instead, we're gonna do 
I want Marika's Scar Seal. There we are. And I also want my Intelligence up. Thank you. And lastly, we are going to do just the potency of sorceries. There we go. So now... Oh, Mount... Mount Gilmere, but I can't go anywhere? Oh, yes, I can. <laughs> uh, right. So here I am. So I guess I need to make the approach here. Ah, okay. I see where I am. I see where I am. I see another Sight of Grace not too far. We might as well go grab that, right? Yeah, let's, uh, let's do that. I don't know if Mount Gelmir is where I want to actually head next or not, but I'm all about collecting Sights of Grace. It seems like a wise decision. So is this Seethe Water River? Seethe Water River. All right. I could absolutely be using Torrent right now. Now what, uh... Oh, this is a new ruin, or is this part of the Wyndham? This is probably part of Wyndham. Yeah, I think this is. Also, do I see a Divine Tower? Not from here, I don't. Okay, so if we just ignore that and we try to ride up the river, where do we end up? Also, let's grab some golden rawas. I need to go on a regular rawa raid. That's a RRR, if you will. Ooh, hello. You look exciting. All right, glintstone arc. Can't dodge that. And what do we get? We get barrage. Hey, that is, I think, a weapon art typically used for short bows. But that could be kind of cool. So let's see. Archery skill using a bow held horizontally. Ready the bow, then fire off a rapid succession of shots faster than the eye can see, usable on light bows. Yeah. So I tried that when I was doing my guide. Is this Formic Rock? Oh, Volcanic Stone. Okay. When I was making my guide for the killing the grafted cyan at the beginning. Whoa, that's hinting at something. Give me arrows like that. But I, I tested out using the short bow. I forget what class starts with that. And the barrage was cool, but just did not do nearly enough damage. Lots and lots of volcanic stone. Ow. Sorry. Oh, I see a golden seed. Cool. Let's see how many this actually gets me. I think I have two. I don't know why I got off the horse for that. I didn't need to. Yeah, so that makes three. Cool, but not enough. Uh, is this... Oh, that's the... Is that the dead Earth tree? Have they destroyed a minor Earth tree? I guess kudos to them, right? I also see an imp door. That's exciting. Oh, the smithing stone five. Okay. Where are my threes? <laughs> oh, something happened here, though. We got basilisks. Who are running away? Are they running away or trying to run to meet me? Hmm. All right, let's just get some glintstone arcs. Okay, that'll take care of you. Hey, come back here, please. Oh, that might actually kill you. Oh, there we go, perfect. Oh my. Whoa. Wow, I jumped, I jumped, I jumped. Not even afraid to admit it, I jumped. <laughs> oh my heavens, that was terrible. I mean, that was good. Is that gonna get the unsuspecting bonus? It is, excellent. Then I'll take the nascent butterfly, thank you very much. That was terrifying. That was horrible. Um. Okay. Just for fun. Just for fun. That's really cool. 
Ooh, that means I'm really low now on these keys. Um, where am I headed? Seath Water Cave. Okay. I think we might have found the spot for our next adventure. That actually lasted quite a while. Not mad about that. Not mad about that at all. Right under the base of one of the old minor earth trees. But that's going to do it for this episode. Hope you're still enjoying. And I'll see you back here in Seathwater Cave.